Uh, t- tough, tough loss. Uh, we, we really, we way too many mistakes tonight, 19 turnovers, 29 points. Um, you know, it's, it's going to be hard to win games like that. Um, so look, I, we're frustrated. Um, we're, we're going to, we're going to be fine as, as a team. Uh, that's a, that's another really good team we just played. And, um, you know, we, we didn't do a good enough job of, of taking care of the ball. And then making making it hard on others. We, you know, Steph had Steph did what he's going to do, but we made made the night hard on him. Uh, he missed some shots, but then the rest of the guys had too much. So um, we're going to get better. Uh, we're going to we're going to we're going to win some games. Uh, but it was a, another tough one for us tonight. Yeah, the seven turnovers for De'Aaron. Does he what? What you're seeing in practice? Are you seeing that translate over or not? I mean, he looks like he's forcing things a little bit overall yeah uh i thought tonight he did a little bit i mean it's it's ridiculous that as quick and as aggressive as he is uh he shoots one free throw in a game where we only shoot 13 uh, and the other team you know he's got plus 10 on us on that and um so i think part of it is you know there's probably some frustration from not getting a whistle and then he's trying to get himself going and uh you know i, I think he's expecting big things from himself this year as we are so um you know i've said multiple times he's he, he's the the head of the snake for us and um you know he knows he needs to play better and and he will uh, but yeah it's it's you know trying to find that that rhythm still luke uh, 17 to 13 your team was outscored at the, the start of the fourth quarter. Yeah, that killed us. You can't do that. You can't give Steph Curry and, and Draymond Green a, a six-point lead when they come back in the game. It, it just can't happen. We talked about it as a staff, as a team, really. And um, But it's one thing to talk about. It's another thing to go out there and do it. And give give the Warriors credit for, you know, the Gary Payton, you know, he's, he hadn't played in a while and he stepped up and knocked down some big threes. Wiggins hit that big three right before they got back in. Um, but yeah, that, that, I mean, that's, if that happens, it's going to be your chances of, of winning that game are not great. And with all that said, we still cut it to three, buddy hit a, a, a three in transition. We got to stop and we're pushing it late. Uh, and, and then we, you know, we threw another Aaron pass. So uh, a lot of, uh, a lot of, what made it hard for us tonight was self-inflicted, which at least that means we can fix it. And building off that a little bit, I believe you, you've been outscored by 30 points um, combined in the, the three fourth quarters. You and the team have talked a lot about not too concerned about the offense compared to the focus defensively. Yeah. Do you think there needs to be a little more focus return to fourth quarter? We, we need to be much better in the fourth quarter. Um, yeah, we do for sure. Um, and that starts with, look, we want to keep, we're, we're part of the problem is we're like, we're, slowing the, the pace down, which I get is somewhat natural in the fourth, but we got to get out. We got to get out and go. So, um, yeah, we need to be much better in the fourth quarter. Yeah. Hi, Luke. I, I asked uh, Harrison a little bit about the adversity that you guys keep hitting, especially late in the game. And he talked about just being more disciplined, taking mm-hmm. care of the basketball. How do you make that in-game adjustment to make everyone buy in and stay disciplined in those moments? Yeah, it was. It, it it comes with learning. It's part of the process of learning, you know, how to win consistently in this league. Um, and it's it, it's being strong with the ball. It's setting hard picks to get people open. Like you know, the other team's defense is going to pick up the intensity down the stretch. Um, and we have to we have to be better at executing those little details that Harrison's talking about. Uh, to continue to create open shots. And, and that's really what we're trying to do. And if we get open shots, we'll make them. Um, but we, you know, there has to be a full understanding of what it takes to, to do that down the stretch. Luke, uh, Davion had a really, really nice game. Um, but it seems like you guys have, like, for every guy who steps up, another guy kind of has an off night. And do you feel like you guys are just kind of missing you're not quite firing at all cylinders yet? Yeah, I, I think that's fair, James. I, I think that um, you know that that will that will come, and that's when we'll start putting some some wins together. Is when that happens. But right now, I, I, you know, we got a lot of guys. We're a deep team, and we're playing really hard, and we're giving ourselves chances to be in these games against really good uh, Western Conference teams. Uh, 
but it's not lasting long enough. And, and, and to your point, there's, you know, it's, it's not flowing as well as it needs to. And we're hitting through at, throughout the game. At some point, we're hitting these little dead patches right now um, that we need to, we got to, you know, we got to fix. Hey, that's just a follow-up question to uh, Coach Cook. Deion had, you know, a good game, the first game, and Oliver and Mitchell, Damian and Mitchell, you know, was trying to find their way. Now, Oliver and Mitchell seem to be picking it up. And not to say that, you know, Deion is taking a step back, but that's where that flow comes in there. What can you do to get that part, you know, those guard units? All yeah, that, I mean, well, one thing that is is the experience of continuing to play together. I mean, at the end of the day, right, Davion's a rookie, ties in his second year, and and Fox is, um, you know, got the most experience out of all of them, but he's still a young player. So part of that comes with uh, the experience uh, of the individuals and the the experience of the uh, you know of the guys playing together. Um, so we'll keep practicing. We'll keep having this, these games that we're going through. Um, and, you know, as long as everyone stays bought in and continues to work, then uh, we'll be fine. Luke, um, I think as James maybe was pointing out earlier, there's been a little bit of unevenness from certain guys in their performances. And are you surprised, though, that, that De'Aaron is, is, you know, kind of there right now, given that, you know, he's – kind of a guy who's been here he's pretty established he's played with pretty much everybody here is there can you go a little deeper into maybe what's going on there yeah no i mean i think it's just you know he'll find his rhythm and you know he knows uh he knows how how good he is and he knows when he plays at at the highest level how how good our team is so um there, there's no concern there uh and, you know, De'Aaron's, you know, he, he puts a lot of responsibility on himself and, you know, it, it is not on him. It's, it's on our team. It's on our coaching staff. It's on our group. So, um, you know, we got, we got all the confidence in the world and we'll keep looking to, to make adjustments to make it easier for, for him. Um, and our team will, uh, our team will play better. Luke, but he didn't score his first points until the fourth quarter. It looked like the team was trying to get him going. Was that a call from you coming off the bench, or was that a call from Buddy, the starters? Uh, what, which, which, Just getting, what, getting him going, getting him some looks in the fourth quarter to try and get him Yeah, going. I mean, we need, you know, I've said it, we need Buddy scoring. He's When he's making shots, it, you know, especially at, uh, at home here, I mean, the crowd goes crazy, and it's, it's, it's big for us. So, you know, we really missed his his scoring in the, in the first half. But um, – yeah, whenever he's on the floor, I'm trying to create ways when the opportunities present themselves uh, uh, to get him a look. And then in the flow of the game, uh, we're looking as one of the reasons we like to push in transition. You know, that's where he, he, you know, he finally, you know, knocked one down and you get him in transition. So um, he's a big part of what we try to do.